Hi everyone, I hope you're all having a very good day. My name is Lydia and in today's video I'm going to show you my favorite places in Washington DC. I moved to Washington DC one and a half years ago to study law and now I'm full-time focusing on starting my own business and also running my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm partnering up with EF Education and I'm bringing you my EF guest vlog, showing you all my favorite places in Washington DC you definitely need to visit if you're going to study here. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Washington DC, the United States capital, and today I'm going to take you on a tour of my favorite places to eat, to see in Washington DC. And behind me you can already see a little sneak peek of how beautiful the city is, as well as the very famous Washington monuments. So it's time to go to our very first hotspot today, which is Emissary, one of my favorite places to grab a quick coffee or lunch. So let's go! It's right behind us and it's really cold outside right now in DC so I can't wait to get a nice cup of hot chocolate or coffee and uh, just enjoy my time chilling there so come on let's go we are now at Emissary and I'm enjoying an oat milk latte and this is one of my favorite places to hang out with my friends we get some work done because I always feel very productive in this corner and I also love the marble countertops so I'm now gonna enjoy my latte and I'm also eating a lovely chocolate croissant so yeah bon appetit <laughs> So guys, we are now at Joe and the Juice and as the name suggests, they have juices here. This is my favorite one, it is called the Pick Me Up and indeed it is as a little everyday pick me up. I also got an avocado sandwich and they are really good here too. So I would definitely highly recommend this place if you want a juice, something to eat or a very chill environment to work in or study. So cheers to that! Okay guys, new day, new discoveries in Washington DC. Uh, we are now in this area which is kind of the heart of DC. Right behind me is the Capitol, which is probably one of DC's most famous and recognizable buildings. Then right there you'll see the Supreme Court, another obviously very important building in DC and all of these buildings are free of charge to visit which is pretty amazing and then right there is the Library of Congress So 
so we are now at our next stop of the Washington DC tour and this is one of my favorite buildings in Washington DC called the Library of Congress. I just love looking at the architecture here and just walking around um, because it is that beautiful. the little peak of the Library of Congress and right now I'm just quickly going to show you the Capitol because it wouldn't be a Washington DC guide without actually seeing the Capitol so let's get going It is time to get some food after hanging out outside and it's still pretty cold in DC. We're now at this diner called Crimson and it has a really American aesthetic. So um, yeah, gotta enjoy some pancakes, milkshakes. Definitely a good place if you want to get some real American food. This is the end of my guide to Washington DC and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to thumbs up this video, subscribe to EF Education and also check out my own YouTube channel if you're interested to see more of Washington DC and more of me. In sum, I think Washington DC is a very underrated but amazing city to study at. It's beautiful, it's clean, it's safe and it's also very close to New York so you can definitely add a day or a weekend trip to New York as well if you study here. So with that being said, it's time to go and I hope to see you sometime again. Bye!